Today, I am only gonna be talking about flannels because I've said it in the past, as the weather starts to get colder, all I'm gonna be wearing is flannels. It's one of the best pieces that you could pick up for men's fashion, so that's why it's so important that you have a perfect flannel. But if you have no idea where to pick up the perfect flannel, today I'm going over six best places that you could check out to find the perfect flannel. Anyways, without wasting any more time, let's get straight into the video. All right, so the first place that I'm gonna be checking out is going to be Ross, because that's exactly the flannel that I'm wearing right now. Now I'm saying Ross because that's where I picked up this flannel, but there are plenty of alternatives out there. Pretty much any discount department store is gonna be a good option. If you don't know what that is, pretty much discount department stores get clothes from other brands that couldn't sell their flannels for whatever reason, and they put them up on Ross, so you're getting brand names for half the price. So this flannel usually retails for about $30, which is pretty normal for a flannel, but I ended up buying it for only $15, so it was a really good pickup. You could definitely find a bunch of flannels at Ross, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, whatever discount department store is near you, I highly advise that you check them out so that way you can pick up the perfect flannel. Anyways, the next place that I recommend checking out for flannels is going to be Uniqlo. Now, Uniqlo is definitely known for having high quality stuff, so their flannels retail for about $30, which isn't bad at all. Especially the Uniqlo flannel that I have, I always get questions about. Everyone always asks me where do I buy it, and I'm letting you know right now, it's Uniqlo. Because every single time I put it on a video, I get questions, I get comments. Everyone's asking me where did I pick up this flannel, so I definitely recommend that you check out Uniqlo. So when it comes to the $30 price tag, you're definitely not sacrificing anything because you're getting exactly what you pay for a lot of places overcharge for flannels or other places charge less for a flannel but the quality isn't really there but when it comes to Uniqlo you're getting both you're getting quality and you're getting affordability so I definitely recommend that you check them out the next one is gonna be Hollister now this flannel retails for about $40 but it's not bad at all because this flannel is definitely the heaviest and thickest flannel that I've ever picked up so like I said for me the weather is finally starting to get cold but sometimes it gets too cold so sometimes a normal flannel isn't really gonna cut it so I need something a little bit more thick and heavy and this Hollister flannel is gonna be exactly what I choose so literally for an extra ten dollars you're getting a flannel that's a lot more thick it's a lot more comfortable for the colder seasons this flannel I definitely use it more to layer so if it's really cold outside I wear a hoodie and then I wear the thicker flannel over it so it's not a bad pickup for only forty dollars now this one is the most expensive out of the list but like I said forty dollars really isn't that bad so you should definitely be checking out Hollister for your next flannel all right the next place that is a really good option to pick up is going to be Gap now Gap is definitely more of an underrated store most most people I know just walk right past it in the mall but if you're making that mistake of just walking right past it I highly advise that you just go in check out the flannels because you can find some really good pieces in there now the flannel that I bought is $35 it's another flannel that I always get questions about and for the $35 price range it's not bad at all now in my opinion I feel like Gap has definitely stepped it up recently when it comes to the quality because I walked in I seen that flannel and I immediately decided to pick it up because it was so soft and when I put it on I realized it was so comfortable so this is definitely one of my more go-to flannels and like I said you could pick it up for only $35 at Gap. The next place is going to be H&M. Now this one's more on the budget friendly side because flannels here can range anywhere between $20 to $25, which again, that's really good for a flannel. But when it comes to H&M, I know a lot of people don't like them because of the quality or whatever, but if you're on a budget and you need a quick flannel to pick up, I think H&M is gonna be a good option. Now this flannel, I don't really wear too much, but nonetheless, it's still a really good flannel for the price. It's definitely not the worst quality flannel that you could pick up, but for $25, again, I definitely recommend it, especially if you're younger and you're still growing into clothes. For example, if you're 14 right now, you're probably gonna grow a lot, but the time you're 16 because I like to keep my clothes for a long time because the Uniqlo flannel, the Hollister flannel, I've had them for well over a year. So those are more high quality, but that's because I stopped growing. But if you know you're in the middle of a growth spurt right now, H&M is definitely a good option. So you can pick up something really quick. And by the time you grow out of it in a few months, you didn't waste a ton of money because the flannel was only $25. The next place that it's a perfect option for a flannel is going to be thrift stores. Now thrift stores, I recommended them in the past, again, if you're on a budget. But the only downside when it comes to thrift stores is when you walk in, you really don't know what you're gonna get. And that's because thrift stores only sell what they're donated. So it is a bunch of random clothes. So like I said, you're not guaranteed anything, but it can be a really fun way to buy some new clothes. And again, you can get pretty lucky because you could find some brand name pieces for literally a fraction of the price. Now the flannel that I picked up, it's not brand name, but it only cost me $4. And it's another flannel that I always get questions about. And again, I picked it up from a thrift store. So one thing I really like to do, I like to go in thrift stores. I like to put on my music, look through the entire things, try to find something that I would like. Again, it could be brand name or it could be something completely random. Either way, the price is probably gonna be the same. It's gonna be like three or $4. Or you can even get extremely lucky. I found so many pieces at the thrift store that still had tags on it. So it was brand new. 
home. So again, it pretty much just comes down to like how lucky you are. Either way, there's probably a bunch of thrift stores near you that you haven't checked out. So I would say go to a few of them. The most popular ones that I have been to are Goodwill and Salvation Army. But either way, if you're looking for something quick and affordable, in fact, really affordable, like I said, only $4, you should definitely be checking out some thrift stores. So those are gonna be the six places that I'm mostly gonna be going to pick up some new flannels, but there are plenty of other options that you can choose from. The only reason why I didn't name them is because currently I don't have any flannels from them that I could show you. But anyways, here are like some little honorable mentions. Just in case you didn't like any of the stores that I named, if you want some other places to check out some flannels, I know Paxton is a really good option to check out. Again, Walmart, you can find some flannels for a very, very low price. I know Cotton On sells some really nice flannels as well. So, But again, it just all comes down to where you're at because, because stores in the US are gonna be completely different from stores in like Europe or wherever. The best thing that I can tell you is try to look for some stores that you really do like. For example, me, whenever I go to the mall, I always end up going to the same places so try to find your go-to stores that sell some really nice affordable pieces that fits your style and fits your budget anyways when it comes down to flannels they are very easy to style that's why I like them so much you can wear them by itself like how I'm wearing them right now you can wear it over a t-shirt or you can even wear it over a hoodie if it's more cold outside so they are very versatile I really recommend that you pick some up if you haven't already but anyways that is pretty much it for today's video so I hope you did enjoy and if you did make sure to leave a like I'd really appreciate it and if you haven't subscribed already in this channel I simplify men's fashion so make sure to subscribe right here and if you want to see more videos about that here are a few that i think could really help you out anyways other than that i hope you have a great rest of your day and i'll see you in the next video later